Hey everyone, um, so I just arrived to the hotel, the Hard Rock Hotel and Casino here in Vegas. I'll be working the Team Edge booth tomorrow at Muscle Contest Legends Classic. Um, for more information, you can go to musclecontest.com. Um, but I wanted to quickly go over uh, a few other things. I took you through my six pack bag and how I packed my food to get here and to get me through the next couple of days um, and combating any kind of eating out that I might do. Um, so I also wanted to go through, I brought all of my supplements with me, so I wanted to go through those and kind of talk a little bit about each of them, why I take them, when I take them, and all of that. So um, I brought everything. I don't necessarily need everything this weekend, but I brought it just in case. Um, for example, I got here tonight and realized, well, found out that the gym closes at 7 and I didn't get here till 8. Um, and normally today is my chest and back day. So I'm going to be switching that and doing plyos here in my room. And then tomorrow I'll do my chest and back. So in that case, I'm able to switch up my supplements and I have my leg day supplements with me and my rest day supplements for Sunday. So um, I'm just going to go through all of them and talk a little bit about them and then um, I'll explain them to you, but um, I'll be explaining all of them to you. So um, here I've got Phenibute. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but that's how I pronounce it. Um, this I stack with my Sleep GH. Uh, but I only stack these. Uh, I have to get up early most days to take my middle schooler to school. Uh, we get up at about 5.30 uh, and we leave at 6, 6.30. So um, if I know I'm going to be having to get up and my husband's not going to be the one taking her, I don't add the Phenibut as that just leaves me a little groggier if I don't get my full night's rest. So then I just do the sleep GH. Um, but even the sleep GH alone is just, it's great. It's not like overpowering, but it really helps to relax me before bed, calm my nerves, calm my mind. You know, at night we're all busy and our minds are constantly going. And this really helps me to calm down, relax, and just go to sleep nice. Um, but again, not feeling like I've knocked out the Phenibut. Uh, gives it a little bit more potency is what I found and if I can I go with the two of these because I wake up feeling like I got the best night's sleep I have great dreams and um, it's amazing so anywho, those are those two um, I would definitely be using those tonight I use them almost every night but tonight as I drink coffee on my drive I'm gonna need that definitely so and I have my CLA. This I haven't used a lot yet. I'm still getting used to it, learning about it, and um, trying to remember it because it's a fill you take it with every meal is the directions. And um, so, uh, well, three times a day, but I've taken it the days that I do take it, I remember to take it with my pre workout meal and uh, that's about it so I'm still learning about this one but I do have it with me and I'm gonna try to remember to take it it is um, for weight loss support it helps uh, fat burning and all of that it is a, uh, a fatty acid like uh, your fish oils and things like that but from what I understand it's a little bit stronger which is why I switched to it and I'm gonna try it before this one, I was using um, the salmon oils that you can get at Costco. So then I've got my fat burner powder, and I have this in pineapple. It's my absolute favorite flavor. Anything I can get in this flavor, I get uh, as bomb diggity. It tastes delicious, and I love it. So the fat burner powder, I take almost every day. The only day that I don't Oh no, that's a lie. I take it on arm day too. So um, I take it almost every day. Maybe not on my rest day, uh, unless I'm trying to get through chores or something, then I would use this. This is going to give me energy like a pre-workout, but it's not going to be as potent. 
Um, but it feels like taking like B12, I guess, would be equivalent to it. You feel energy without any kind of jitters or anything like that. So um, I personally, I love it. I can take it and again, it's not like overpowering. So that's kind of the theme with all of the Prime products that I found. They do what they say they're gonna do and yet they're not like overboard. They do the job effectively without kind of making you feel like you're all overdosed on supplements. So uh, now I have my EAAs. I love these guys. Um, I take them a couple times a day. I take them either during or directly after a workout. Uh, sometimes I will take it before workout. I'll add it in with my fat burner powder and my creatine, anything like that that I'm taking pre-workout. Um, but most of the time it's during the workout in my water or afterwards, directly after I'll mix it in a shaker more um, concentrated and drink that on my way home. Just um, if I drink it more concentrated, I feel like I get a little bit extra water retention and pump for a minute, but um, as long as I'm drinking my water, that goes away. Um, so I have this in kiwi strawberry flavor. Um, it's good. If it came in pineapple, I would love it. <laughs> Um, so this has your BCAs in it also, and it's just your branch, branch chain amino acids um, and other essential amino acids that help. They're the building blocks of protein, basically. So um, building blocks of muscle and all of that, you, what you need to build muscle. So muscle recovery, and um, if you're lifting heavy and all of that, you need to feed them with the right stuff. This is gonna help you do that. Um, uh, on top of your nutrition and making sure you're getting in your protein and your carbs. So next I have Blackstone Labs Hype. Um, I'm loving this. It's flavored orange and it tastes delicious mixed with pineapple or even by itself. It tastes almost like a cream sickle. So yummy. Um, anyways, Nitric oxide boost, I take this on arm day especially. That's when I'm gonna get, like the nitric oxide boost is gonna be the vasodilator, I believe is the way you pronounce it, but gonna give you the veins and that extra blood flow to the muscles that you're working really hard. Um, the more blood flow you get to your muscles, the better as it's getting all of the proper nutrients to those muscles that you're fatiguing um, so that they can rebuild. Okay, then I have digestive enzymes kind of off the prime line for a minute. Uh, I get these at NutriShop Riverside by me. Um, these have your pre and your postbiotics in them for digestion. And um, I take this two capsules with every meal when I'm on prep. Definitely, I don't miss a meal with these. Um, when I'm off prep, I kind of forget. So I take them mostly when I'm feeling bloated or if I have a cheat meal, then I'm like, oh crap, I need my digestive enzymes or cheese, like anything like that, dairy. My stomach doesn't handle well anymore. So I definitely take these when I am eating that stuff. So it just helps with digestion, healthy stomach, that kind of thing. Um, and I love it. I found that when I'm taking this, my bloat is down and I'm also a lot smaller in the waist when I'm taking this. So there's that. Um, I have my creatine here. This does not have a flavor per se, but it does kind of have like a, um, I want to say it's like lemon flavor. Uh, so it doesn't mix well with like a chocolate protein or maybe a vanilla. I've never tried that. I'm not a fan of vanilla protein. And I actually don't drink a lot of protein shakes, like I said earlier. Um, in any kind of situation. If I do, it's in my off season, but it's still extremely rare. Um, just in case of an emergency and I'm not with food, then that would be what I take. So I mix this actually with my fat burner and the EAAs and I drink it on the way to the gym. I get it in at least 30 minutes before a workout so it can start to do its job before I get um, to working. So I use this only on my arm day, um, as that was recommended to me by my coach. 
I'm not trying to build my lower body in any way, shape, or form. I'm just trying to maintain and keep it tight. So, um, but I am trying to build up my arms and put size on them. So, using this, and that has helped tremendously. I feel a lot more strength in my lifting and my weight has gone up a lot. Not my personal weight, but the weight that I'm lifting has gone up. I was curling 30, the 30 pound crowbar.